Okay, so I'm pretty certain I mentioned this in one of my previous summoning videos. And apparently, this mode actually gets up to Super Battle Road difficulty. So I'm hoping to reach that point. Oh, of course. You know what? I was actually about to cut the video there, but I have a decent amount of stones. So let's go ahead and just do this. Because I honestly have been meaning to do this for quite a while. So I may as well go ahead and do it now. Uh, actually, I may have to end up bother shopping a few things. So just give me a few moments. Okay, now it's time to take on the new event. I was about to say the new event there. No distractions. So apparently, obviously, the tech team is going to be the best for this. But let's stick with this for now. I mean, yeah, there are definitely a few weaknesses in this team. But apparently, a 100% LR Goku paired up with Bardock does like 250k damage against some of the later stages. So that is extremely scary. So maybe you do need to use this team. I don't know. I honestly have absolutely no clue. Pardon me. Of course, I am going to find out later on. Let's start things off with the Gogeta, who, of course, is 100% in a potential system. How much is this going to hit for? So, he's still hitting pretty damn hard. How much are we taking in turn from the super attack? 42k. So, the debuff actually made a massive difference there. Maybe it's just because his defense is super high. But how much is this going to do him? So, his health is clearly in the millions at this point. You know what? Every little bit of damage helps. Even though it was only 49k. And let's go ahead and take him out with Gogeta here. Right, so that is this one done. I believe that was level 8. So now we are moving on to level 9. Apparently, level 20 is absolutely insane. So, this mode isn't easy. It's not easy like a few people thought it would be. Which I'm kind of happy about. But at the same time, it's like, well, this is certainly going to be a repetition of Super Battle Road. But then again, you can still awaken the Goku to a point, but you may struggle to get some of the later medals, obviously. So we have another Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta attempt. I really wish I had better units in those last few slots. I mean, Boris is a good unit, but he's kind of not that great on his team. I mean, I could just change it up. We can use tech-type units on his team, but that's one thing I keep forgetting. And this is legit an all-star lineup. We cannot go wrong here. Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta, Super, um, Super Gogeta, as well as Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks. All who have level 15 crit, I believe. I'm not too certain about the threat, but we are going to counter here. Uh, is it a crit, though? It's not a crit, but it will still do a nice amount of damage. Okay. We technically... Well, I say technically. We should be able to take him out of this rotation. I would be very surprised if we don't. Very, very surprised. Yeah, I think he's done here. There's no way I'm going to lose at this point. I can't. I mean, it's not so much about losing, but it's more about getting through the stages at a decent pace and of course he has the tightest amount of health left but thankfully Gotenks is going to take him out here. Whereas using these teams is probably going to be a bit better just because you have way more health. So I'm definitely going to be rolling with this despite the fact that we have a few weaknesses in the team like I pointed out earlier. Of course we have the SDR Gotenks. You know what? I think I'm going to make a change to the team. I think I'm going to be making a quick change. So is this level 10? So we are now on level 10. Let's go ahead and grab ourselves a... Is that? Okay, that is 100% right. Let's grab ourselves Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta friend. Um, I mean, the issue is kind of is the fact that we miss out on a bit of a health boost because we don't have certain units. Let's go over to physical, get rid of the Gotenks as well as the Weirus, and then we can move from there. So I ended up going... If, oh, fucking hell. So I ended up going... So I ended up going with, oh my god. So I ended up going with Ella Black and Zamasu as well as Super Saiyan 3 GT. Just because more tech type support, of course, type advantage and such. And let's put him there. And then we also have the healing from Ella Black, which is going to be very, you know, very useful. Especially when you consider the fact, um, the fact that we aren't getting, you know, we aren't getting like any healing or anything. From the units that we currently have. So that's going to be useful. Of course, okay, I was about to say the Goku can stun, but he can't stun clearly because he has the icon now. But Ella Black and Zamasu definitely thinks is going to be a very good unit for this team in particular. Of course, he has the capability to tank as well, which is going to help out massively. Alright. And how much is this gonna do? 77k, so. Not so tough just yet, but I definitely feel it's getting to that point relatively soon. It's a shame that Gogeta does not have Prepare for Battle, because of course he would share that with the LR, but it's pretty much over at this point. 
How much damage are they going to take here? Okay, not, not, not so much. I definitely think this is the team to go with. But again, we need a balance between the fusion units and the tech types just so that we do get a significant increase to our health, which is the most important thing. Survivability is very important, but we are making good progress here, and I am probably going to cut these parts out between levels just so that I can speed it up a little. Okay, so now on level 11, and I saw something pop up regarding the Goku, and I think it said that his defense is going up, or it went up. So this is going to be interesting to witness. All right, here we go. So his attacks are certainly hitting harder here. And is the green screen okay? I'm hoping it's not like all messed up. Okay, I think it's fine now. Because it doesn't seem to be moving. All right, here we go. Deep same for Gogeta. What can we do here? And okay. His health is definitely rising here. I mean, we still have a lot of our health left, but it may cause us a few issues later down the line. Um, honestly, let's lead with this. Put Gogeta here. Prepare for Vassal. And then grab this with Gogeta. Okay, so we are going to raise the defense of the LR. He isn't going to hit too hard, but he's mainly here for the healing, obviously. And his ability to tank and hit relatively hard. Well, Gogeta with the debuffing. And the fact that he can hit hard as well. Kind of wish I had additional attacks now instead of the dodging, but who knows? It may come in clutch at some point. And we can still get additional attacks at... That is the point I'm talking about. It came in clutch right now, even though I didn't necessarily need it. And that wasn't exactly clutch. But the point is, he dodged. At, like, when I pointed it out, which is what matters. And I honestly wish I had my Gogeta that I had on Global on this account. Because I would just be steamrolling this. Enemy level 12. So we are definitely making progress here. Getting very close to the later stages. And honestly... I think we could take him here. I definitely think we could take him here if we don't. Okay, I was about to say we have the LR next turn. Why can't we not have the LR next turn? That would have been so useful. Okay, the attack stat that, well, the amount of damage that we are taking with a type advantage is certainly rising here. How much is this going to do? Nowhere near as much as it was before. Well, to be fair, it still is. One million. Which actually surprised me. And we have Gogeta. In before he dodges a super attack. 1.3 mil. So the debuffing definitely is making a difference here. Of course, when Super Go um, or Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta super attacks, I should say, his defense does go up as well. So when you combine that with the debuffing from Super Saiyan, well, yeah, Super Saiyan Gogeta, he is capable of tanking very well. And that is this stage taken care of. Okay. Again, haven't encountered any issues just yet, but I would imagine that I am going to face the harsh reality of this mode relatively soon. Here we go. Do Super Saiyan 3 do more damage? I don't know. Was there, what? Was there a link actor there? Well, I'm not going to find out. Level 13. We are making progress for sure. Okay, this is definitely a situation where I have to put Gogeta there just because of the type advantage. I have Elder Black and Zamasi next turn as well, but not exactly the best key placement. Okay, this Gogeta must have several potential system buffs. I mean, not too many, but he definitely does have a few. Because I'm taking, like, not as much damage as I was before with my other friend. Hey, we didn't get a super attack, surprisingly. But it could happen against super... Uh, well, I'm going to keep saying Super Saiyan Gogeta. Even though he technically is. But Super Gogeta is just what he's known by. Right, can we dodge here? Okay, we don't dodge. But 6 to 3k. Uh, like, I haven't encountered any problems at all. A lot of people are saying Super Battle Road. I, I'm still yet to see it. But then again, I'm still quite a bit away from that point this could potentially present a few issues oh dear see the key placement wasn't the greatest here but maybe we can get lucky and get a crit here and sorry what wow uh yeah i, I think i'm experiencing that right now so wow um so, the units without a type advantage just not hit that hard? Is that a thing now? Okay. So, I think I'm starting to see what people mean. He legit got a crit. Wow, I'm actually baffled. Right. This should take him out. Unless he somehow gets some crazy defensive boost. And still 1 million. I'm actually confused right here. 
So supposedly the team that you want to go with is Super Saiyan 3 or Tech or just Extreme Tech. I don't personally see it. This is working for me right now. I've seen quite a few people say that apparently level 17 is a bully. So I'm curious to... Well, I want to encounter that myself. But again, I haven't encountered that many major issues yet. My Gogeta is still hitting extremely hard and we are about to counter here, thankfully. All right, is it going to be a crit though? It is going to be a crit. How much? 1.5 mil. I might. Just, is the game broken for me or something? Or I mean, Gotenks isn't going to hit that hard, in guaranteed. Yeah. So is Goji are just simply broken, or I think you need to have a type advantage. I think that's what it is. Yeah, definitely type advantage. If you don't have a type advantage, you're done. You are done. Uh, well, can't do much here, so I'm pretty certain this is going to be enough to take him out. Again, it's a shame that Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta does not have Prepare for Battle, but it should be enough to get rid of this stage in particular. But we are making good progress here. Definitely making good progress. We've been recording for almost 15 minutes, but I don't know how much of that is actually me taking on the event. So, I'm going to keep going until I die, I suppose, and then I will see you guys at that point, I guess. Okay, okay. Oh, and there it is. Okay, there it is. Yep. So that's what I mentioned earlier. And it needs to change as well. Okay, this is getting pretty scary, admittedly. Oh, boy. This is where I'm definitely going to encounter a few issues. This is where. Oh, and it begins. It actually begins. Oh, wow. Okay, 200k, 100k. Let, let, let's have it. Oh, that wasn't so bad. Okay, fair enough. Oh, I underestimated Gotenks. Tech types for... Oh my god, my health. My health right now. I'm about to take a major L here. I can feel it. Ah. Uh, uh, kind of. Not really. Okay. Uh, yeah, go STL Gotenks is going. Vegito is in. 100%. Right. Um... I am being blessed right now. Why does this... I'm so annoyed that he doesn't have prepare for that. Um, the, the, the healing of the LR is just so important. It is so important here. I think I'm, I am going to beat this stage, but things are definitely getting difficult. Things are definitely getting difficult. Okay. Here we go. And apparently there's like 31 stages, which is absolutely insane. Okay, I, I mean, I'm still doing a nice amount of damage, but not as much as I was doing before, clearly. Oh, wow. Okay, well, DLR is just going to do what it can. 263k. Additional super attack, though. Okay, that was a massive surprise. Maybe a crit as well. Okay, just do the same. I'm actually curious to see how hard Gogeta can hit here. Because, of course, he is effective against all types. So, he should be able to hit as hard as Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta here. But, will he be able to? I'm actually taking quite a bit of damage from these attacks now. I see what people mean by Super Battle Road level. I definitely see what people mean. I mean, it's not quite that point yet, but it's, it's definitely getting there. But, I should be able to take him out with Gogeta here. Wow. Okay. And, there we go. I think I'm going to do one more stage. And then end it there, but this has certainly been a crazy ride. Okay, one more stage. No cuts here. And then I'm going to definitely separate the next part into a different video because this is getting insane. Stage 15. We have made progress. So we did just get the two Kai's there. Wow. It, this is getting tough. This is getting tough. Um, Apparently Super Saiyan 3 Goku is no good. Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta. Just set all of your Super Saiyan 4 Gogetas. Um, I... Why did I keep Super Saiyan? Or base Gotenks, I should say. Right, last one. And I do have the LR next turn. But we want to go over this. I definitely need to prepare the Super Attack for next turn with the LR. So let's go over this. We have a nice, um, no, whoa, nice amount of purple orbs there. But we are going to raise our own defense with a Super Attack here. Would be nice. I actually can't get an additional super attack because I don't have any dupes. Rip. Got the crit though. Which is just as good. This is definitely where that mistake with the whole dodging thing and Gogeta is going to come in clutch. Guaranteed. So, yeah. Absolutely no issue. Oh my god. Okay. 
What? Yeah, run your tech type teams. Don't listen to me. Run your tech type teams. Oh boy. Um. Oh wow. This could be bad. Okay, let's play it smart. Just don't super attack go tanks. Just do not super attack go tanks. We did heal up a bit of health there. Thanks to Elmo Black and Zamasu. Yeah. STR go tanks, you're going by. Tech Vegito, you're coming in 100%. You are coming in. Just all tech types are coming in. Okay, we've got the crit. We got pretty lucky there, admittedly. Go tanks are going to hit for like 2k. Probably. I don't understand how people's Super Saiyan or El. Are you kidding me right now? Are you freaking kidding me? Oh, oh, oh my, oh my god. That was by far. I have never been that lucky, okay? I have never been this lucky. If that, if one attack was at the start, game over. 100% game, um, game over. Could have put Gogeta there and potentially dodged. But that's relying on a massive chance. Okay, good game. That was extremely lucky. Of course, he super attacked physical go tanks. But I hope you guys did enjoy the video as always. And if you did, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe for more. I will see you, um, see you guys tomorrow for the next part of this incredible mode. And yeah, I will see you all in the next one.